oil and water don't mix, so water can't go to that area. And water is what makes the cake. Water is what creates all the really cool formations that we're gonna see. So I know they look super cool and they look awesome, but we can't touch them because when you touch them, um, you're kind of destroying that area, you're preventing any further growth. So we want to be able dripping and stuff is just from seeping mm -hmm. So this is all secondary formation, all this cool stuff here. Uh, I like stopping here because it's just an example. You can imagine the water flowing down this um, and leaving all that calcite behind very slowly. And uh, when it does, it does, when calcite has recently been wet, recently deposited, it's really ones um, easily older than any genetic sequoia. Over here you can see he's had water on him recently. He can make it kind of dried out early in the season. Um, so we've been in caves and using caves for a long time. We just have to be aware of our surroundings and how to interact with caves. And the people we use in this time. More than that, that's like not a whole lot of water, but I'm um, not a crazy amount. You know. We don't really know exactly how much, it's hard to tell. 